hey guys so it is vlog day 18 it is late night and i'm hungry so i decided to come and fix myself something really quick for dinner for myself and my husband and since it is meatless monday and i haven't really been eating a lot of meat anyway but i decided to go ahead and make this uh chicken teriyaki with the garden uh chicken teriyaki what is it called the chicken strips from garden and so um i'll just show you a little bit of footage of me cooking it and definitely if it's something that you're interested in maybe trying meatless monday is sort of one of those initiatives hashtag meatless monday where try to give people an opportunity to um, incorporate meatless meals into their diet you don't have to use some sort of meat substitute it could just be taking the whole day or just a one meal out of the day where you don't have meat in the meal so something definitely think about give it a try trust me you'll definitely notice a difference in how you feel when you start eliminating a lot of meat from your diet not just red meat and pork but meat in general so Anyway, just wanted to share real quick, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. So tonight, what I'm preparing is this teriyaki chicken. And, I mean, doesn't it look like real chicken, right? It does. But this is from Garden, And so far, I've been trying different um, meatless products from Gardein and they all have been really good. I made the meatballs the other day, gave them to my husband and he did not know that they were not meat. And so I have been pretty much liking the Gardein brand. The only catch about Gardein is that they are soy based. And so some people, you know, don't really do the soy because of the estrogen that's in it so they try to avoid um meatless products that have a lot of soy in it and garden does have soy in it so i usually only eat this meatless option like once a day i just don't uh, eat it like all day long in my eating garden stuff plus it is processed and you know, part of the healthy lifestyle is, of course, trying to eat as much clean food, which clean means, you know, that it's less processed. So, I mean, meatless substitutes are processed. So, you know, you don't want to fill your whole diet with meatless food. So, this is what it looks like in the pack. I was able to find this at Target. Our Target doesn't have a full-on grocery store, but it does have a grocery like section, a small one. So I got it from there for I think this size bag was like four dollars. And most of my other Guardian products, though, I have been able to find them at Walmart. So if it's something that you want to try, you know, you don't have to feel like you have to go to a health food store or a Whole Foods. You can find some of this stuff right in your local Walmart. Target stores and yes I know it's kind of char but I kind of like my my that so it's all good and it comes with like a pack of teriyaki sauce so I'm going to add that and then boom. Um, so I forgot to mention that I cooked this in coconut oil so I just put some coconut oil right the same time we use on our hair and body Put some in the pan, let it melt, and then I stir fry everything in the coconut oil. So I just added the teriyaki sauce packet. You can see, I turned the heat down some just because I don't want the sauce to burn too much. But it's kind of a thick sauce. And I'll just put some cayenne pepper on this and some regular freshly cracked black pepper. And boom that's dinner and i normally don't eat mine with rice um like you traditionally would just to kind of cut back on the carbs even though brown rice is nutrient dense it is still a carb nonetheless so being i'm trying to watch my carbs i usually don't eat my stir fries and stuff with rice i just eat it 
you know, just the meat and the vegetables or the protein and vegetables. And but, but my husband, he'll eat it with the rice. So there you have it.